Road rage. It goes without saying that anyone that has been in a car on the road has suffered from road rage. I live close to Montreal, so if you live in the area, you must know exactly how frustrating it is to drive in this area. I mean, it's incredible how many idiots there can be on the road. Like, how the fuck did these guys get their licenses in the first place? Were their instructors drunk? I mean, what do they care? It's not like they're the ones in the driver's seat during the road exam anyway. But hey, maybe they just forgot to tell their students that they need to use their turn signals when they're, you know, turning. Well then, I guess they got drunk all the time because none of them seems to know how to use that damn thing. What, is it supposed to be a decoration to be all pretty in the nighttime blinking like a firefly? Oh right, sorry, it wouldn't be blinking because you never used a damn thing. And if it's not the turn signals you're ignoring, you're somehow ignoring something even more important. Tell me, do you know why it's called a blind spot? Because you can't see it on the mirrors. Okay, do you know why you need to turn your head to check it? Well, they're obviously not in front of you because otherwise they wouldn't be called blind spots. So tell me, why do you think we actually need to check this spot? Oh, I don't know. Maybe there's another driver in that f***ing spot. Seriously, are you so irresponsible about everyone's and your own life that you wouldn't bother checking that spot before changing lanes? And don't even get me started on the people who don't check those blind spots and don't use their turn signals. Okay, I changed lanes now. Good luck, everyone. It's like death waiting to happen at any moment just two feet away from you. And what is the deal with tailgaters? Is the rear end of my car so attractive to you that you have to stick to it like a couple trying to have anal? You know that sticker that says, if you can read this, you're driving too close? I should just make one that says, if you can read this, I'm slamming my brakes in three, two... And you know what else I hate? Gee, Zero, what else do you hate about drivers? Actually, that's the thing. This one's not about the drivers. It's about the pedestrians. Now, I don't know what it's like outside of Montreal, but pedestrians here really piss me off. They either can't see the color of the traffic lights because they're colorblind, or they just don't value their life as much as they should. I know drivers are supposed to respect pedestrians and whatnot, but if I'm waiting at an intersection and you're taking your sweet ass time crossing it when the light is already green for me, can you please hurry your ass to the other end? And don't give me attitude when I have to slam my brakes to make sure you get out of it alive. Cause if I'm approaching the intersection and the light is green and your ass is still on it like a sightseeing tourist on ecstasy, it's your ass that shouldn't be there. And let me remind you that you most likely weigh less than 300 pounds. A standard five-seater car? At least a ton. I'm pretty sure it's not hard to figure out if it's going to be metal or your body that's flying a few feet into the air. Look, I understand if you're elderly and you can't walk any faster. But if you're obviously young enough to have found out what puberty was just in the last 10 years, I think you're energetic enough to go a little faster. Otherwise, you're getting a free trip to the hospital and the doctors are gonna have a great time with you. And no number of apples is gonna get you out of that one. His name is Zero, and don't forget to like, share, and silly subscribe for your Zero Motivation of the Week. And if there's something that you want to share about Road Rage, let me know what it is in the comment section below. And if you have a topic you want to suggest for the show, be sure to leave that in the comment section below as well, or simply tweet at me at ChannelAZ. For next week's topic, Respecting Critical Thinkers. And that's all the time I have for today's episode, and I hope you stick around for next week's episode. But until then, my name is Absolute Zero, and always remember to keep it absolutely cool, everyone. Oh my god! Oh my god! I just saw him. Ah, I'm gonna get me in Ah! Oh my god! Oh god! Oh god! Oh god! Come on! 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 Come on!